Section 4 of The Silence What it is, how to use it. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by L.T. The Silence What it is, how to use it by David Van Bush. Section 4 Thought to hold in meditation in the silence for misfortunes, grief, mistakes, reverses, failure, sorrow, loss, and disappointment. All is good. We are entering upon a new consciousness for the human race, a higher plane of mentality, and a greater development of the spiritual life. In spirit, of course, there is no wrong, no sorrow, no grief, no misfortune, no losses, no reverses. In short, all is perfection. The age in which we are living has not yet developed this spiritual understanding. We are still of the earth, earthly, and we are still in that consciousness where the physical is affected by seeming misfortunes, reverses, sorrows, griefs, trouble, sickness, etc. We may be wise in not expecting that suddenly this generation of man will reach that spiritual plane where there will be no recognition of anything except good. We are a part of the infinite spirit ourselves, and of course, in spirit, we are perfection. But this physical body of ours manifests imperfection from time to time, because of our past training and past thinking, because of our own consciousness. In time, there is no doubt in my mind but that the spirit within will make a perfect body without. This perfection will be recognized in health and in peace of mind. It will be recognized so that there will be no such thing as misfortunes, sorrows, reverses, failures, griefs, disappointments or losses being able to affect our mentality or our body. In this state of consciousness, as we are emerging from the chrysalis material stage of man into the greater life, into the deeper spiritual understanding, we are subject to certain conditions not conducive to peace of mind without an effort. In other words, we recognize or feel the effects of losses, misfortunes, disappointments, sorrows, griefs, etc., we recognize now that the time is coming when the spirit will be so completely in control of matter in the body that we will not recognize any in harmony. To reach that great spirit is one of the big forward steps in this generation. To reach that spiritual plane also means the right kind of thinking now. We plan today for tomorrow. This is true in every walk of life. We plan our home today and build it tomorrow. We make our merchandise today and market it tomorrow. We sow our seed today and reap the harvest tomorrow. We build our career today, little by little, and we reach the outcome tomorrow. Therefore, our thinking today will change our tomorrow. The thinking of this generation will change the condition of tomorrow's generation. If tomorrow's generation is going to be free from the recognition of sorrows, misfortunes, griefs, fears, pain, losses, failures, reverses, inharmony, discord, etc., it depends upon our seed sowing. Our seed sowing today should be, all is good. All is good in spirit. You can say that and be honest with yourself. All is perfection in spirit. All is good for us in spirit. All is good for our lives here. Spirit transcends matter. When we recognize, affirm, and continue to hold the constructive thought that all is good in spirit, we are changing our own mental attitude our own bodies, all matter in general, getting ready for the greater realization of the spiritual manifestation in the next generation. Therefore, for your own good here today in success, prosperity, and happiness, as well as in health, peace, and harmony, begin to pronounce over everything in life, all is good. If you have any misunderstandings, all is good. If you have any losses, all is good. Any reverses, all is good. Any sorrow? All is good. Any inharmony? All is good. In everything at all that is out of perfection, you must recognize only the good. All is good. Sending your thought energy by repeating all is good, and thinking all is good, and living all is good, you will actually, in this day, overcome your difficulty and turn all of your mistakes, blunders, and misfortunes into stepping stones for your own success, health, and happiness. I enter the silence this month, this day, this hour, and this minute. 
my mind is obsessed and under control of the divine spirit i recognize here and now only good i see in my fellow men only perfection and good i see in nature all around me only perfection and good i see in every transaction of life only the perfect good i see in every activity of my experience and in every form color and thought good all is good for me now today and forever god is spirit spirit is love love is perfection god's spirit is harmonious i am perfect i am love perfection and harmonious all is good end of section four